Hey, hey, you guys, cats, cats. Are you seeing cats in your dreams? Are you seeing small cats? Are you seeing large cats, small cats like your house cats? Are you seeing large cats like pumas or panthers or jaguars or even, you know, lions of some sort? The Bible talks about the enemy, that he goes around like a roaring lion, seeking those whom he may devour. And so these are not cats that are here to play with you. They're not here to be friendly. They are here to attack you and to take you down and out, especially the large ones. They are of high levels of, of witchcraft and sorcery. And so you want to make sure then that if you have dreams like this and where if you see any type of cat, it doesn't matter if they look cute and nice and oh, you know, you look like, like my cat Bojangles. No, you need to make sure that you present this to the Lord right away. Pray about it and ask the Lord God to deal with whatever it is that you are facing. The Lord sees and knows everything that's happening and going on in the spirit. And he sees these individuals that are engaging in witchcraft. And then you need to ask the Lord, say, hey, I'm giving this over to you. Lord, send your angels even to arrest them. And can you deal with them according to your judgment? The Bible, there is Bible text about this, about those who engage in witchcraft. The Bible says, suffer not a witch to live. And so it's not your duty to go and, you know, spread curses on them uh, like they may be trying to do to you. But it is also your duty to pray about it, commit it to the Lord, and let him deal with it as he sees best and fit. I've seen situations and heard of situations also as well where the Lord has uh, been uh, gracious to some. They have repented of their sins because the Lord came to them and they repented and they let these things go. Others, it was instantaneous judgment and they perished right away. And so some people are just unrepentant. You know, they've, you know, maybe steeped in whatever it is that they're in. Their heart is unrepentant and they choose not to seek forgiveness of the Lord. And so that's on them. That has nothing to do with you. So again, Commit it to the Lord God, but know that you were dealing with some lower levels of witchcraft and others are high level sorcery. You know, it's it's steeped, it's it's big, deep stuff. So again, nothing for you to take up on your own. Commit it to the Lord God. He will fight for you. God will fight for you. There are angels there. They deal with this stuff all the time, you guys. The Lord will fight for you. All right? Hold your peace. Trust in the Lord. I love you guys and know that Jesus loves you infinitely and abundantly even more. And I will see you next time. And if you have had dreams about cats, let me put that down there at all. You know, drop it in the drop box down below. I'd love to hear about it. We are a community. We're here to share and encourage each other and lift each other up. And so let's talk about that. All right. See you guys later. Ciao. <laughs>